Hi friends, how are you? I hope you are very well. Welcome to my channel, The Personal Cozy Project. And today I am very excited because I am reading Mansfield Park. I've started reading Mansfield Park this month um, because I am participating in a really nice book club. And so we will, we will be having the discussion about the book, I think, on the 27th of um, June. And so I am rereading uh, Mansfield Park and I am enjoying it this time even more than last time. I think I like especially, I like the first part, uh, volume one of Mansfield Park. Now I, I am in chapter 15 of the first volume. There are three volumes. So I'm planning to do a lot of reading on the weekend to be able to <clears throat> to read all the volumes. This is the volume two and volume three. Um, and it is a good preparation for Jane Austen July. I am really on, in the mood and I am really looking forward to this discussion about Mansfield Park and also to Jane Austen July. And I, I just watched a video with uh, Gina uh, from the channel Gina, Gina Stenger Books. Um, and uh, yes, she inspired me to, to drink also a cup of wine and enjoy my, my reading. Um, and uh, also I thought about Rainy from Rainy Day Reads because she uh, often enjoys a cup of wine um, while reading or while, while talking in these really nice events that she hosts. So I thought, uh, let's do the same. Let's just drink a cup, of, a cup of wine and relax. Cheers, Gina. Cheers, Rainy. And cheers to all of you that are watching this video. I've been enjoying this part of Mansfield Park and I found a passage about uh, Fanny's room, uh, the East Room it is called, uh, because at the beginning Fanny didn't have any nice room uh, to just to write or to read, but then um, just because Maria Bertrand didn't uh, want, didn't need and want the room, then um, she started to use it and now it is her room and I, I found a very nice description uh, about her room. Do you remember this description? Uh, the aspect was so favorable that even without a fire it was habitable in many and early spring and late autumn morning to such a willing mind as Fanny's and while there was a gleam of sunshine she hoped not to, to be driven from it entirely even when winter came. The comfort of it in her hours of leisure was extreme. She could go there after anything unpleasant below and find immediate consolation in some pursuit or some train of thought at hand. Her plans, her books, of which she had been a collector from the first hour of her commanding a shilling, her writing desk and her works of charity and ingenuity were all within her reach. I really like this um, passage because it sounds really cozy and I think uh, most of us would like to have uh, such a room, a really special room where you can just relax and read and write and just get inspiration and think. So I would like to have a room like that. Um, do you have a room like that? Uh, please tell me in the comments. I am really loving it. and. Um, I am thinking about uh, buying some books uh, for Jane Austen July, a celebration, um, and to do my first haul. I have never um, done a, a, a haul in my channel, and so I thought it would be a good opportunity to celebrate that I uh, now have a, a channel and that I am reading more and that I, can, uh, I will be participating in Jane Austen July. Uh, I saw uh, one, two wonderful books uh, in Gina, uh, Gina's um, channel. They are so beautiful. Uh, I also would like to buy them, but I think this time I would like um, I would like to have another collection. I just have this collection. 
and uh, they are really nice but uh, they are a little bit difficult to to, to use uh, what I like about this book is the the color of the of the pages I prefer these these pages and I really love the cover oh I love this this green it's just uh, green gray or green but what I don't like about this this edition is that the really beautiful um, uh, illustrations fade away I don't like that, that at all um, I don't understand why um, Hannah Tay, uh, do you know her channel? Have you heard about her channel? I love her channel and uh, she she made a video about that that's, that the that the how do you call that? I don't know, I'm sorry the illustrations, I don't know how do you call them fade away and I, I think that's not so nice but so I would like to have another edition of all the of all the um, books uh, by Jane Austen and then uh, later I would like to buy those beautiful um, editions that Gina show us in her in her channel and so I will be doing uh, very uh, soon I think yes in two weeks or something like that a haul that would be great and yes I am really excited for Jane Austen July <laughs> I still have to do uh, I, I am planning to do uh, different videos because um, I would like to to find a, a suitable book for uh, the prompt uh, to read a book by a contemporary of Jane Austen and I made a video about Udolfo so that's not for me Udolfo uh, sadly because it, it sounds really exciting and interesting and I, I read some pages and the pages are really and the descriptions are beautiful but uh, so I, I won't be able to read it but uh, I am thinking about or how can I say, I am planning to do more videos about uh, which books I will be reading or I will be trying to, to read in uh, Jane Austen July, uh, some contemporaries of Jane Austen. I am very excited about doing this, those videos and uh, doing a little bit of uh, research to decide which book I will be reading. So if you already know which book you are reading, please tell me in the comments. Uh, I would like to know if you already have uh, your TBR and your chosen book for this prompt that I think is really interesting and exciting. So I wish you a very nice day or evening or afternoon uh, whenever you are watching this video. And so I wish you a very nice time reading and I hope to see you soon. Bye.